Alrighty, hello guys, welcome to Paces back to another video on my channel. Today we are going to be continuing on with the submarine, as you guys can already tell, because I'm stood on it. Yes, I am. Uh, so in today's video, what we're going to do is we are definitely going to add a heater. Uh, we're going to mess around with this thing as well a little bit, and I think we're going to add some lights to the underside. Uh, I haven't decided what else we're going to do, so that's going to be kind of interesting. Also, before this video does begin properly, if you guys are enjoying this series, leave a like in the video down below, and uh, also comment what you guys want to see in the future. But for now, let's go ahead and get on with it. Let's grab it. Let's go. So, what we're going to do first is we're going to get a heater that is going to heat us up when we are inside the vehicle. Yes. We're actually going to go ahead and put it in the airlock, which um, I want to say doesn't make too much sense. Uh, but at the same time, it will work there. <laughs> so the reason I'm putting it there instead of anywhere else is because it's actually in the middle of the uh, the submarine. Uh, it being in the middle of the submarine allows us to heat up the entire submarine uh, without actually having to do very much. So that's pretty good. Let's go ahead and label this heater. There we go. And we'll attach this directly onto the heater, which is in here. Then we're going to pass the electricity through to that winch. Yep, I guess that's fine. And that button has already got it. So that's all epic. Very good. The next thing I wanted to do was I actually really want to add some lights to the underside because when we are out and about down there, we can't really see very much. So adding some lights will help us out. So let's do this on both sides. There you go. Delete this piece right here. We'll actually go backwards. We'll delete that bit. We'll delete. Well, really, I wanted to delete that one, but I can't. So we'll delete this one instead. Uh, then we'll delete this one and then we'll delete this one. And that should be good. That's going to be a bunch of lights. Uh, which should be fine, uh, to be totally honest with you guys. I know there is a bit of an issue where it might be that uh, we'll die. If if we have these lights on too long, then the electricity will run out and then we'll die. But, you know, I'm trying to make it so we don't die. So let's just put all of those in. Let's paint them all, actually, because at the minute, they're all the wrong color. There we go. All right, paint that bit white. There we go. Excellent. Paint that a little bit as well. Uh, paint these pieces, and those pieces, and all of those pieces, and all of these pieces, and there we go, we're good. Nice. That makes it look way better. Sort of. Kind of. I don't know. Right, okay, so that's all of the lights on the underside that we need. Let's go ahead and give those guys some electricity. Yes, this should be relatively easy to do. We're just going to attach them to each other, and attach them to something in the vehicle that is already attached to the electricity. So that's good. Uh, the light is right there. There we go. Excellent. Do you have any other lights around here? I thought there was a light in the middle of those, but apparently not. Uh, we're going to attach this light. We're going to attach this one, this one, and this one. There we go. Yeah, there's a light here that I didn't see. There we go. Excellent. And I believe that is actually all of the lights attached together, which is awesome. Yeah. So they're going to get turned on by, by this thing right here. This is going to be dock. No, underside. Lighting. There you go. So underside lighting. Let's go ahead and give this electricity. Already has it. Um, ooh, what am I clicked on there? That's helm six. Now we want the underside lighting to be on a button, please. All right, so this one, this one, this one, this one, this one. Uh, the one opposite, which is there. All right, excellent. That one, that one, this one, this one. And I think we're good. All right, spawn it in. Let's go. Let's go for a drive, shall we? We're going to see if the heater works, and we're also going to see uh, if the lights on the underside actually do do their job. So we're going to do this and this. I need to... Oh. No, that's fine. All right, excellent. Let's go. Let's go, go, go. I need to invert those control surfaces on the back as well, uh, because at the minute they are actually inverted the wrong way, and that's not what we want. So there you go. Uh, I might also put an artificial horizon in this, because I think that's probably a good idea. But anyway... Uh, I want to press 1. I want to lower ourselves down to the bottom of the ocean. And I want to attach ourselves on. And then I'll turn the underside lights on. And that should be pretty sick. Yes. Yes, indeed. Alright, okay. So we are, I think, going down. I could be wrong. <laughs> I could be wrong, but I think we are going down. Uh, our depth is somewhere. I don't know where our depth is. Oh, I don't actually see it. What is that? I don't know what that is, but uh, it's okay. We are still going down towards the surface. Okay, here we go. And it is somewhat working, I think. Yeah, okay. We're almost there. How's our battery doing? It is definitely using it. I think we need more batteries in here. 
uh, or something because they seem to get used pretty quickly. Uh, and that's not amazing. Maybe this thing shouldn't be as, as fast as it is. That does make some sort of sense. I think if this thing was slower, that would make a lot of sense. But yeah, anyway. We're going down towards the surface. We've attached ourselves on. Now we can put this back to zero. There we go. Excellent. Then we'll put the underside heating on. And there it is. It's very blinding, actually. So I'm not sure about that. Uh, and then the heater does actually work. So let's go outside uh, in a diving suit. There we go. Outside we go. Let's dive underneath and see what it actually looks like down here. It's just too bright, isn't it? It is very, like, it's extremely bright down here. That's not right, that. That's too bright, I think. I would say that that is too bright. So we might change the colors of these. Uh, and I think the colors that we need are actually gray. I, I think we're going to make them gray. So go to paint. Yes. Go to this paint. Yes. Go to, like, dark gray. Go on the underside. Paint that bit, that bit. Uh, they're doing it on both sides. So that's excellent. Paint these as we go. And that should be good. I think that's fine. Yeah. So they're going to be gray now. Let's go ahead and spawn it in. We'll jump on the boat. We'll turn them on straight away and we'll see what happens. I think it'll be fine, but I'm not sure. So close this up. Go inside. Very good. There we go. If it's still glary, then that's not right. So underside. It's still glary, but it's not. It's nowhere near as bad. So I think I'm okay with that. I do. I think I'm okay with that. Uh, right. Okay. The other thing that we need is navigation lights. I do want to put them on here somewhere. Uh, I just don't really know where, so we'll, we'll try and attach some of those. I think right there, you know. I do. I think actually putting them in right there is fine. So lights, we'll make them white for now, I guess. Yeah, sure. Um, that's all fine. We'll go ahead and paint this bit in. Do, 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 do. Do, 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 do. There we go. Excellent. Paint that a little bit. Paint that a little bit. Uh, and I think that's fine. Yeah. We're also going to have to delete this piece. I want to put one of these in. There we go. Excellent. And then I want to paint this bit like this. And that should be good. So that's done on both sides. I can't remember which side is green and which side is red. So uh, let's Google that. Nav lights. There you go. Um, uh, 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 left is red. Okay. Left is red, guys. So red. There we go. And green. There we go. Excellent. So what that does is gives us navigation lights for when we're on the surface and also, I guess, for when we're underneath as well. So that's okay. So navigation lights are there. I need to somewhat figure out what this is. I, I need to know what that is. That is our speedo. Okay, speed. And I also kind of want to put all the lights in the same place. Because at the minute we get spotlights, we've got interior lights. Then we've got underside lighting up there. We've got the ballast stuff there. We've got a heater right there. So I think this needs to go down here. So let's move it. All right, cut it. Move it sideways. Very good. Move it backwards. Move it down. Paste it in. All right, merge it. Go. There we go. Excellent. That works. And we'll also just fill this in with a, a block. And there we go. Very nice. And paint it. There we go. So that is actually fine. Uh, that is merged. Yep. We've got the underside lighting. We've got the spotlights. And we've got an, our interior lights right there. I think the interior lights are going to be on automatically, because I think that makes sense. And there we go. All right, next thing. Let's paint it a different color. Woo! Woo! Uh, dark blue actually looks pretty cool. Green. I don't know. Purple. Ooh, damn. Yeah, let's make it Charlotte's purple. There we go. Nice. All right, excellent. Very good. Uh, so there we go. We've actually painted it purple. Uh, we've got our submarine. It does work. We've added extra lights. I'm happy with that. I am very happy with this. Uh, our navigation lights should work as well, which would be excellent. Uh, and then there's only like, I don't know what else we need. I don't know what else we need. There's definitely other things. Do we need weaponry? I don't know. Is there going to be like sharks in the cave that we need to fight? Who knows? So let's, uh, let's get ourselves some spear guns. Uh, and hopefully that will be our defense mechanism. Hopefully we won't need it, actually. is more what I mean. But, you know, it's fine. So specialist ammo. We're going to put that right there. We're going to do the same thing right here. And we'll have another one there. Because this is realistically only meant for two people. Uh, but there is three seats, just in case we need them. Uh, there's also a bed. So if we need to rescue anyone from down in the ocean, at the bottom of the ocean, we can put them in the bed. Uh, and that'll be fine. All right. Excellent. Excellent. I think we're doing good here. Uh, I do actually kind of want to block off the back end right here a little bit too, though. Because uh, obviously we do have seats here. 
Um, and I'm not sure I like the idea of just having seats there, so we're going to block that up a little bit. Like that. There we go. Excellent. And yeah. Yeah. Pretty weird. <laughs> I don't know how I feel about this, but I've, I've done things back here, so that's all good. Let's undo the deleting session that I've just had. Now I'm confused. When did I delete this? Don't know. Right, okay. So, I don't know. Should we have that? I don't think we should have that. Let's get rid of this. Actually, let's get rid of that too. And that. There we go. We'll get ourselves an angle. Uh, a pipe. Yeah, but inside a box. There you go. All right, put that right there. So that gives the seats a little bit of a backing, and I think that's actually a good thing. So, yes. All right, paint that a little bit like that. Paint that a little bit like that. All of this like this. And there we go. We have some seating, guys. We have some seating. Very good. Uh, right, okay. I'm happy with that. I'm very happy with that. Uh, if you guys could think of anything else that I really need to add to this thing uh, before we actually go deep diving in caves, let me know, because I, I'm going to struggle to figure out more things. Uh, I am going to add an extra line for Nemo's. There you go. Uh, and then when it goes back to orange, which it might do, or, or it might go red, who's, who knows, um, then we'll, we'll look like a Nemo fish. A Nemo! Very good. All right, okay. So we need to paint that bit as well, paint this little bit. We need to go around the outside of this, which means that this should actually be white too. There we go. Uh, and that's fine. Very good. We're then going to go across the underside, just like so. And it actually lines up with the winch, which is perfect. All right, go inside of here. Yes. All right, I need to paint that little bit, but I can't. So delete these. Paint it in. There we go. Grab another one of these. Put it back in. There we go. All right, guys, I did it. I did it! Everything's painted. The underside looks like a bit of a mess, but that's alright. Um, the only other thing that I can think of doing would be to add like a, um, like a little system of uh, these, like anchors, but lower. So like we delete this, we'd have a bar come out here, we'll have it full of anchors, uh, we'll be able to anchor, anchor it to the side. But we won't do that today. We won't do that today. Alright, okay. What did we actually do then? We added a heater, we added some lights, uh, we added some navigation lights. I, I'm happy with that. I've got a very runny nose, so I'm going to have to end the video here. Because <laughs> I need to go blow my nose. But if you guys can think of anything else we need to actually do with this thing, then let me know. Actually, before we do end... Before we do end, I'm actually going to go ahead and flip these over. Because they are currently the wrong direction. So there we go. Alright, paste that there like that. I'll do the same with this one. Cut it, flip it over, paste it, merge it on. And there we go. Merge this one on as well. Excellent. So now that's all done, it's all it's all correct. Um, we might need some firefighting gear on here eventually as well. That would actually be pretty cool. Uh, but for now, I'm going to leave it as it is. Thank you guys very much for watching. Hope you guys enjoyed this video. And I guess I'll see you guys in the next one, where hopefully we'll have some suggestions on what to do. Anyway, thanks for watching. Hope you guys enjoyed it. See you in the next one. Goodbye.